think the idea that palliative care has had a hard time being accepted is very real because I think oncologists have associated it with end of life and with, with uh, hospice care. And I think in order to get a better image of palliative care, they have begun to talk about it early on, symptom control from the beginning. So I think that's it's a, a new definition of palliative care. Will it make much difference? I'm not sure. But at least it, we now know from a study from Mass General that people actually survived longer when their, their symptoms were well controlled. So that's a very important study. It's a landmark study from two or three years ago. I think that psychosocial issues are embedded in that. So. I don't prefer to call them palliative care because I think that stigmatizes it, to tell you the truth. But I prefer to call it psychosocial care, or, we, or the management of distress. We've used the word distress to get away from the stigma attached to psychiatric issues, psychological issues. Nobody likes those things. Too mental, too, too embarrassing to ask about or tell about. And doctors don't want that. So we hit upon the word distress, which, has, which we've begun to use much like um, we did with pain, how's your pain level zero to ten? We now have a distress thermometer. 